Let's take a quick look at a couple different places that we can find our Apple ID password if we're already logged into our iPhone and we don't remember exactly what it was. If you're updated to iOS 18 or higher, then the easiest method to do this is through the new built-in passwords app. I have the app here in the middle of my screen. It's called Passwords and it has three keys on it. But if you can't find it on your iPhone, just swipe down anywhere on an app and then search for passwords here. Once you find it, just tap this to open it up. Once inside, you'll see categories for all of the different types of passwords that you've saved to your Apple account. You can tap all to see every password that you've ever saved, but since we're looking for our Apple ID password, I'll just use the search bar at the top and then I'll search for Apple. After you start typing in Apple, here at the top, you'll see a few of the top hits. If you have more than one Apple ID or different email addresses attached, then find the one that you want to find the password for and then choose it here. Inside of here, you're going to see your username, which is the email address that you used for your Apple ID. And then underneath of that, you'll see password. At first, these are going to be dotted out for security, but to view it, just tap the dots and then you'll see it appear there. You can then choose copy password from the pop-up that appears and wherever you're trying to log into your Apple ID, you can then use this now to log in. Now, you should be able to find your Apple ID and password using this method, but there is another place that we can check, and that's if you've ever saved it using Google Chrome. To check this, I can close the Passwords app, and then I can either find the Chrome app on my home screen, or I can swipe down again on any app and then search for Chrome inside of here. Now, once you're inside of the Chrome app, make sure that you're logged into your account, and if you use this, you should already be and then tap the three dots on the bottom right hand corner of the screen. Once you're inside of here, use the top menu bar here to scroll over until you see password manager and then choose this. And now just like the passwords app, use the search bar at the top and search for Apple. And again, if you've ever logged into your Apple ID and saved your password inside of Chrome, you'll see a result here and then we can choose it and then view the password just like before by tapping on the security dots here to reveal it. One last thing that we'll look at is if neither of these worked and you just can't find your password anywhere, then you're gonna have to reset the password. Luckily, Apple's made this a lot easier lately, so we'll go ahead and walk through that real quick. I'll close Chrome and then find and choose the settings app. Next, tap your name here at the top and then on your Apple account overview page, tap sign in and security near the top. Inside of here, you'll see all of the email and phone numbers and the different ways that you can sign into your account. The second section is called security and at the top, you'll see an option to change your password. Choose this. You'll then have to go through a face ID or another two-factor authentication, but once it confirms your identity, you can then set up a new password. Just enter what you want to use and then retype it to confirm. And after that, you should now be able to find it inside of the Passwords app that we looked at in the beginning. And that's how you find or reset your Apple ID password directly on your iPhone. Thanks for watching.